I am Dominic. I consider myself a moderate Republican. I... Well, no, I'd probably sit, consider myself more of a liberal Republican if, because of my views, but I'm a Republican by heart. Many Republican presidents, such as Theodore Roosevelt, Ulysses S. Grant, Lincoln, Reagan, were some of the best presidents that this nation has seen. They did their part for the nation, and I believed in the power of the Republican Party. But after living through four, four years of Trump, I've given um, I've almost given up on the party. I cannot allow this man to tear down the reputation our party has built. Our zeitgeist was freedom. But now the party is controlled by those who don't agree with that everyone has freedom. They want only theirs to be free. And as long as those in power don't stop this action, there is no stopping the coming wave. You've, I uh, have decided um, in, the, in the near future I'm going to become a political, I'm going to be more politically active and speak out against the modern, Repu the modern Republican Party until our voices are heard. Because I know I'm not the only Republican out there who feels we have been, we have gone, we have strayed too far from our ideals and beliefs. No more can we allow this to no more can we allow the extremists of the party to speak for us. Now is the time to act. We need to vote Trump out. If he wins... The, we if he wins... We, te we have lost, and we have let them control our party for too long. We must no longer rely on the establishment Republicans to challenge Trump's authority. It, we must take it into our own hands. And if that means voting Democrat, voting third party, this election, then so be it. <sighs> we need to rise like a phoenix out of the ashes of this dying party, be reborn anew and show the United States that the Republicans will not accept this kind of, that we will show the work people of the United States that the Republicans are not Trump, are not his cronies. We are the party of freedom, liberty, democracy. We represent this republic. And we will fight for this republic with every last dying breath we have.